Hey YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a wall that the sprite in Scratch cannot walk through. So first you're going to need to make, um, to make like the line that you don't want them to walk through. Um, so I'm just going to make a line right here, right in front of, um, right in front of the sprite. So now you're just going to go into the sprite and um, you're going to want to go and make when flag clicked forever if touching, no, if touching color and then you just click on the color to change it and if touching color black then, wait, no, if, then, ch um, then you're going to want him to move 10 steps, no, so then you're going to want to just bring 10 of, no, 4 of these out, and then do if no and then you only want to put four ifs in a chain like this. You're going to want to put the move ten steps into each of them. So if key if key right um right arrow press then move negative ten steps. If left key press, then move 10 steps. If up arrow key pressed, then you're going to want to make him move negative 10 steps. And then you're going to want to make, to move 10 steps. Point in direction 90, which is right. Point in direction 90, negative 90, which is left. Well, that's what it says on this. And then you're going to want to point up, or you could just make it 10 steps for all of them and make them point in different directions. Um, wait, hold on, I'm just going to change the sprites settings, okay. So then, you probably know what's going to happen. If you guess make it go down, then you're correct. Actually, I'm just going to make it negative 10. So it's going to be negative 10 for everything. And then you're going to, actually, I'm just going to copy these. Okay. So key, this is down arrow, this is up arrow, and this is left arrow. So if you're searching the color black, when I click the flag, if right arrow key press, he's going to move back. And then you're just going to... Um, Duplicate this and put it into the else, and then you're going to want to make it all 10 steps. So I'm going to come back when I do that. Okay, so I just figured out I needed to do something else. So you're just going to take out, put point in direction, whatever, and then you're just going to take out the point in direction. And you're, and instead of having point in direction, you're just going to do direct, if direction equals, oh, if direction equals whatever direction you want in the point in, then move negative 10 steps. Okay. So if direction equals 90, then he's going to move, move negative 10 steps. If direction, wait, hold on. 
So I have finished all of this stuff down in the bottom. But if direction negative 90. So you can't do 270, I think. I'm just going to go negative 90 for now. And then down. Down arrow. Oh, well, need to turn on the flag. Okay, down arrow. Now let's see what the direction is. 180. Which leaves up. Which is zero. Okay, so now, this is going to work. So now we're just going to keep on going back. And if I'm making go like this, he can't go down on it. He can't go left on it. Um, and he can't go up on it. So, yeah. That's all for today, YouTube. So, bye.